When I was in the middle of mowing my lawn, it started to run rough like you saw at the beginning of this video. Now I knew that it had to be one of three things. It was either air delivery, fuel delivery, or the spark wasn't working well. Uh, fortunately, these two-stroke engines are really simple, and so I knew it had to be one of those three things. I started by checking all of the really simple things like the spark plug wire, uh, the fuel tank was full, I checked the air filter and that looked pretty clean. So I figured the most likely thing was probably the carburetor because these things get really dirty, especially since it's operating outside with a bunch of dust and grass clippings flying around. I never thought I'd be making a video on carburetors since they were mostly out of fashion by the time I was born, but they're still used in a variety of applications today. In my case, a two-stroke lawnmower engine. And because I had never really worked on one before, I had to go do a little bit of research. Carburetors come in all different designs depending on their application, but for this simple two-stroke motor, like what you'd find on a lawnmower, it looks a lot like this picture. As the air flows into the carburetor, after, as it passes through the venturi, which is a narrowed cross-section, that air has to speed up. And as it speeds up, it also lowers the static pressure in that area, which pulls fuel in. And that's just Bernoulli's principle. And so the air and fuel mix and then get pulled into the engine and combust. In an ideal case, combustion occurs when we have a gas to air ratio of 1 to 14.7. This varies, of course, but the carburetor has to keep this ratio close in order to make the engine run well. Too much gas and you run rich, too much air and you run lean. Because a carburetor relies on several tiny jets to pull fuel and mix it with the air, small debris can clog these ports and cause the engine to run poorly because it isn't getting the proper ratio. You can work this ratio out if you know some basic chemistry by doing stoichiometry. After I managed to get the carburetor exposed and look at all the parts, I could tell that everything was really dirty and I figured that that was probably the issue. So I just grabbed some carburetor cleaner, sprayed it all out as best I could. Um, I, I would have liked to take the carburetor off and clean it more thoroughly, but there were two long bolts running through the engine that would have taken a lot more work to take apart. So I just decided to clean it right on the lawnmower. After I got it all cleaned out with carb cleaner, I just put everything back together and ran it. it seems to have worked just fine. If you run into a similar problem with your two-stroke engine sounding like mine did, Maybe check out the carburetor and see if it needs to be cleaned.